guys, it's Luke here and welcome back to another video. You join me today with another E92 M3. This one, however, completely outshadows mine. Not only is this a manual car, it's also supercharged. So a whole lot of work uh, gone into this car. I have filmed a supercharged M3 before. That one was a DCT car. You guys may remember that awesome car. This one's gonna be a different experience, of course, being manual. Running around the 680 brake horsepower mark, it's probably gonna change my opinions about maybe supercharging mine one day. Um, but of course, we are joined today with Costi, the owner. We'll introduce him on camera. He can walk us through basically what he's done to it, and then we'll head on out in the car to experience this supercharged manual E92 M3. Okay, so we're joined now with Costi, the owner, mate. Thank you so much for bringing this absolute beast down for the video today. It looks absolutely stunning, absolutely stunning. But we'll get onto the visuals in a moment because, of course, we do have the bonnet open uh, where we can see, well, everything as part of the ESS tuning supercharger kit. So if it's all right with you to give us a bit of a walk around of, of what we're looking at, yep, essentially. Yep, of course. So it's a stock engine. Yep. Uh, it's an ESS uh, supercharger kit G1 Plus with uh, also met injection. Nice. Big pulley as well. So yeah. to squeeze as much power as possible from it. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It's um, Somewhere between 680, around 680, 680 okay. horsepower. Yeah, yeah. It still hasn't nice. went to dyno for the final numbers, but yeah. soon it will go and we'll find out. So it, that's with the meth? Yes, with meth it, and everything it, it gone. Included as well, yeah. Okay, and you say the, the blow-off valve up here? Yes, nice that's the one, so well. it makes a cool sound for this <laughs> supercharger kit. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And this is where the meth is injected in here? Yes, this it? is the fuel that's yeah. uh, pulverizing as a nice, snow, nice. straight in the admission. Awesome stuff. And you said stock engine as well? Yes, yeah. it's stock at the moment. Has quite a few miles on it. Yeah. It's holding up quite good because uh, all the previous owners that had the car, they really maintained it, yeah, took yeah. the servicing. All maintenance is key, especially on one of these. To be it? honest, when I bought it, just a quick one, last owner gave me even the f uh, fuel tickets. Oh, really? Yeah, I have even oh, those all ones. All the receipts? Wow. All the receipts for fuel. Uh, so in, That's in, imagine how yeah. much they took care of it. Even yeah, if absolutely. they changed the uh, bulb, mm -hmm. I still have the invoice for that. Wow, even the little bits like that. Epic. Yeah, so the guy gave me everything, road bearings yeah. in, and engine mounts yeah. and everything yeah. in, the, in the bag. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's awesome. That's so, awesome. Well, being a manual as well, um, yes. is it stock clutch or upgraded clutch? Stock clutch, nothing yeah. changed, just the brakes. We yeah. upgraded to a big uh, big brake kit. Yeah, is that all round? Just up the front? All around, all around. Front and nice. back completely. Uh, suspension, is, suspension is still stock, yeah. just the lowering springs. Okay. You won't see that gap between the wheel and the arch too much. Yeah, absolutely. Visually, though, it looks absolutely stunning. And that's, well, you've yes, done a lot of work we in your company as well. And then change that. Yeah. So all the wrap on the outside, underneath it's a Jerry's black. Okay. Uh, it's in mint nice. condition. Yeah. On the outside, it's a take wrap, uh, blood red wrap, done by us, all the body oh, kit nice. from carbon, installed by us as well. Yeah. To be honest, this color really suits it, actually. Uh, tire really stickers as well, done by us. Yeah. Uh, Exhaust-wise as well, I presume that's exhaust upgraded wise, as well? Exhaust-wise, it's modified. It's straight yeah. full pipe at the middle, and at the back we have uh, two back boxes that's cancelling yeah. a little bit, like 30, 40% of the okay. noise. Otherwise, yeah. Yeah, yeah. won't be able to uh, oh, drive it. Yeah, yeah. No. I mean, I, I rate it the fact that you've done this to a manual, because it, it, it's just that extra bit of theatre, isn't it, really? Yes. Actually, I would prefer sometimes to have a DCT, but yeah. it's more enjoyable in manual. Yeah. yeah. If you like drifting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just but, just dump the clutch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. No, fair enough. Fair enough. A constant project. But I think if that's pretty much everything from yeah. the outside and everything, I think we'll hop in and go for a spin and see, well, see what this well, thing is like. Do. Let's do Perfect. it. <laughs> that sounds incredible. <laughs> and that was without meth. That's without meth. Yeah. <laughs> it is absolutely savage. <laughs> this puts mine to absolute shame. What a sound. Once it passes 5,000, it completely changes. Yeah. And just the sound, the blow-off sound as well. It, it is addictive. 
It is, and towards the end, you can sometimes hear the supercharger going like. Yeah, yeah. That <laughs> all those noises, sound. which is so like unnatural for an E92 M3. handles it really well yeah doesn't lose if yeah. you have good tires it depends on the road surface how yeah absolutely yeah how warm it is because it doesn't have a lot of torque it has less torque than uh, horsepower you yeah. don't lose traction that much that's true actually yeah because that, that was traction fully off right yes it lost fourth and second a little because no you yeah, driving but yeah. it just spins a little bit and then catches and then goes, and goes. Yeah. <laughs> so what I love about supercharged cars is you don't get any lag, it still drives factory, yes, just with a whole host more power. Because being a natural aspirate from the beginning, mm. you have all the power there when you just step it down and yeah. that's it. It's straight away. And it's, it's still like that now. It's even better now because you have a little bit more power at, towards mm. the end of the revs. <laughs> you could just dance with it, can't you? <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> what a car, though. Is, is. Oh my god. And at the moment as well, you're, you're daily driving this as well, aren't you? At the moment, at the moment yeah. I'm yeah. uh, just waiting to sell my other car yeah. and get something else so yeah. I can store this one because it's becoming annoying to drive it daily. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> uh, a lot of times, a lot of people are looking at you and they feel like they want to race a little bit. So. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, those noises going from up front, though. Just when you lift off the throttle, no matter the RPM. <laughs> the noise. Brakes are really good as well, actually. Yeah, yeah they make the Really difference. stamp on them, yeah. There's just so much theatre, though. Mate, thank you so much for, uh, for coming down on the channel with this. What a car. The fact it's manual as well is like the icing on the cake for me. Exactly, it changes um, a lot. Yeah, and I will leave your Instagram as well to King Rap Customs down in the description down below for you guys to go and check out. But yeah, for me today, that is it. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please do make sure you leave a like and make sure you subscribe for all the adventures still to come.